You probably know what QR codes are and how they help connect offline audience to your online content. From product packagings to inventory management, QR codes are everywhere. But like any other technology, they only work the best when used the right way. And many people often make silly mistakes that lower the potential of QR codes. So, ask yourself, are you following the QR code best practices for your campaigns? Well, here are the 7 best practices you must follow while working with a QR code. 1. Give your audience a reason to scan the QR code. That means, your marketing message should be compelling enough to get people to engage with the QR code. And the best way to do that is by adding a CTA with the QR code. CTA is call to action statement that tells your audience what to do or what to expect after scanning the QR code. For example, scan here to get your discount coupon. Next, make sure you choose the QR code's location and size wisely. Many marketers often use the same QR code across various consumer touch points, which may not be a good idea. For example, a tiny QR code on the product packaging would be completely scannable. But the same sized QR code on the back of a delivery truck won't work well. After all, no one will run after the truck to get that tiny QR code to scan well. Hence, make sure you place the right sized QR code at accessible locations for the audience. 3. You must also make sure the QR code has high scannability. Factors such as size, contrast, and clarity affect it. Keep in mind that the QR code must always have high contrast with the background. So if your QR code is dark colored, the background should be light and vice versa. Also, you must try to use dynamic QR codes that convert lengthy URLs into short ones. This makes the QR code look less dense and simpler. For further, since many QR codes, especially the dynamic ones, need internet connection for the users to be able to see the target content, place your creatives in the areas with good internet access. Next, if your use case is promotional, add design to your QR code. You can do it by adding colors and a logo to the QR code. Or you can even use an image as the background. Customized QR codes tend to fetch more scams than their black and white counterparts. And that's exactly what a marketer would want. 6. Also, make sure you download the QR code in high-resolution formats. While raster formats such as PNG and JPG work well for digital resolutions, they are not optimal for print resolutions. That's because they're prone to getting pixelating when resized. So make sure you download the QR code in vector formats such as SVG, EPS, or PDF. Images in these formats don't pixelate despite any resizing. Finally, make sure you always test scan the QR code before putting it out for your target audience. It is recommended to do so using 4 to 5 different handsets and browsers. It'll make sure your QR code works well across different devices. That's it. With these best practices, you can increase the engagement of your QR code campaigns significantly. If you want to see a step-by-step -step guide on how to create a QR code, you can refer to the link in the description. If you found this video helpful, hit the like button. If you have any questions, let us know in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel.